everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how to resolve the photo apps error message. It says that there's nothing to show here. So this should hopefully be a pretty straightforward process here, guys. And without further ado, let's go ahead and jump right into it. So if it's an issue of a particular image, it may be corrupt, in which case this tutorial is not for you. However, if you're opening up plenty of images and you're coming across the same message for all of them, this should hopefully be able to resolve the problem. And without further ado, let's go ahead and jump right into it. So we are going to start off by opening up the search menu. Type in apps and features. Best match to come back with apps and features. Go ahead and open that up. In the apps list field, go ahead and type in photos. And the best match to come back with Microsoft Photos. Select the three dotted icon next to it. And select the advanced options button. On the right side, you want to go down underneath reset. If the app isn't working right, we can try to repair it. The app's data won't be affected. Select the repair option. And hopefully at this point, if you attempt to open up the image again, hopefully it should have been able to resolve the problem. If you're still having an issue, you can attempt the reset option. So if the app still isn't working right, reset it. The app's data will be deleted. Go ahead and select reset. So this will permanently delete the app's data on this device, including your preferences and sign-in details. Select reset. And then once you have a check mark, I would suggest closing out of here and then actually restarting your computer. And then hopefully I should have been able to resolve your issue. One final thing you can attempt here as well is to run a system power checker utility scan. So open up the search menu, type in CMD, best match to come back with command prompt, right click on it, and then select run as administrator. If you receive the user account control prompt, select yes. And now into this elevated command line window, I want you guys to type in SFC, followed by a space forward slash scan now. Scan now should all be one word attached to that forward slash out front. Hit enter on your keyboard to begin the system scan. This will take some time to run, so please be patient. Okay, so you can see it did find corrupt files and successfully repaired them. Go ahead and close out of here and then restart your computer. And hopefully, again, that has resolved your issue. And as always, thank you for watching this brief tutorial. I do positive to help you out, and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.